Hi everyone, I am Shiva Chaitanya, Oracle Trainer. In this video, I want to talk about how can we create the temporary table in Oracle. See, to create the temporary table, follow this syntax. We write like this, create global temporary table, give the table name, in the parenthesis, define the fields. This syntax we have to follow. See, this is the syntax to create the table. Create table, table name. In the parenthesis, we define the fields. This is creating table. But we want to create temporary table. So, for creating temporary table, just we are writing create global temporary table. Give the table name. Define the fields in the parenthesis. So, this syntax we have to follow to create the temporary table. See, I am showing this one. I want to create a new table with the name EMP1 with two fields, employee number and E name. This temporary table I want to create. See, create table. We want to create temporary table. So, write create global temporary table. Give the table name as EMP1. First column, employee number. Number type. Second column is E name. Varcat two type, bracket close, semicolon. See here, table is created. So now, this table created permanently, but in that, records will be inserted temporarily. Observe. Now, EMP1 table created here. I am inserting the records. Insert into EMP1 values 1001A. First record I am inserting. Next, I am inserting second record 1002B. Two records are inserted. I want to open and see the table data. So, right here, select star from EMP1. Observe here, EMP1 table has two records, but this data stored temporarily. When this data will be cleared, sir, so every successful transaction ends with commit. So, after completion of transaction, this data will be cleared. So, I am writing commit here. So, when commit command is executed, now this data cleared. Now, open and see the table data. Observe here, select star from EMP1, no data is there. After commit, this data cleared. So, with this we can understand that this data stored temporarily in the EMP1 table. After commit also, if we want to preserve the data, here we write like this, on commit, on commit, preserve rows. So, if we write like this, when we are creating the table, if we write on commit, preserve rows. After commit also, data will be there. But that data also stored temporarily. So, when you log out, means when the session is ended, data will be cleared. So, if on commit preserve rows is not there, if on commit preserve rows is not there, when commit is executed, data will be cleared. If on commit preserve rows is there, after commit also data will be there. But when the session is ended, when you log out, the data will be cleared. So, this is the way of creating temporary table in Oracle. 